If you want to make progress on the path and ascend to the places your soul has longed for, Teresa of Avila wrote in the interior castle, the important thing is not to think much, but to love much, and so to do whatever best awakens you to love. Hi friends, I'm Mirabai Star, and I just wanted to tell you a little bit about my connection with Carolyn Mace and with the teachings of this book, The Interior Castle by St. Teresa of Avila, because the two things are completely intertwined. I first met Carolyn Mace years ago when I dared to reach out to her because I heard that she was working with the interior castle and teaching from Teresa's mystical masterpiece. And I had just completed this translation and I wanted her to know about it. And so I overcame all my shyness and found a way to reach out to her and let her know. She wrote back right away and she said, well, what are your credentials? Fair question. And I said, well, you know, I've master's degree in religious studies. I spent time in Spain. I'm fluent in Spanish. Um, John of the Cross, I translated John of the Cross, Teresa's protege, and um, blah, 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 you know, education and so on. And I said, but really the, the thing that I want you to know is that Teresa speaks my soul language and it was effortless to translate her because of that resonance. So the important thing is not to think much, but to love much, and so to do whatever best awakens us to love. And so from that place of love, I reached out to someone I loved, Carolyn Mace, whose work had been so important to me. And taking that, what John of the Cross calls that exquisite risk, was exactly the right thing. And so began a friendship that centered around this extraordinary being, Teresa of Avila, who still lives in both of our hearts in such a, a powerful way. So I hope that you will have a wonderful experience exploring the, the grounded mystery of the interior castle of your own soul with this great master teacher, Carolyn Mace, who I am privileged to call my dear friend. Thanks.